Well, first of all, I would like to thank the Almighty, you know, because without him, none of this would have been possible. This means a lot, you know, um, not only for us as a team, but for our fans all over the world. You know, um, I, start, I started, we started the tournament by saying that we were inspired by our only 19 boys in, in Bangladesh. And then earlier this afternoon, the Vader women's team played and won the, the, the cup. You know, all that uh, was even more motivation for us to complete the treble, you know, and uh, it, it means a lot for all three teams and, and for, for cricket in, in the region. All right, um, okay, 19 runs, uh, six balls, all of us in, dress in the dugout, okay, we like three hits, three big hits, that's all we need. First one, over square leg, six, yes, come on, Carlos. Second one, where did it go? Did we make it? Long one? Yes, come on, Carlos. <laughs> one more hit away. You know, and uh, uh, the third ball, six again. One game for me, one. He was halfway on the field. You know, and uh, look, it was just amazing. You know, um, Jerome Taylor sat in the, in the dugout and said, we will win with two balls to spare. You know, and he was spot on, you know, and it was just a joy. We needed this, you know, we've been through so much, and to come out here and, and win this tournament, it, it's, it's, it was just amazing. It, well, um, look, we left the Caribbean, we said we were in it to win it, you know, and uh, the experts, or the so-called experts, the commentators, the journalists, they didn't give us a chance, you know, um, one particular journalist said, uh, we play with no brains. You know, that, I think that comment really, really brought this team together, you know, together with all the contract issues. And uh, the way the men came out and, and play. You look at the side with Chris Gale, Russell, Bravo, you know, Badgley, you know, um, Jason Holder, Carlos Bradford, you know, Suleiman Ben. You know, on any given day, they could have a brilliant performance. And I said we had 15 match winners. People said it was a man, one-man show. You know, and that's been the hallmark. You know, since the 100, you know, Chris has not turned up uh, with the runs. But yet still, we keep win, winning convincingly. So it, it shows that we're not a one-man team. And uh, what I could tell you about this T20 team, it's bringing fa um, smiles across the faces of all the Caribbean fans, you know, and even here in India, you saw the crowd was behind us, you know, so we as a T20 outfit, we, we entertain, you know, I don't know about uh, the glory days where we dominated test cricket for 17 years, you know, that is a, a, an area which we really have to improve, but the success of this T20 team cannot be um, unnoticed, you know, um, we we bring smiles to, to the fans, and that's what we're going to continue to do. Well, the next World Cup is in four years. I, I probably have to get fitter if I want to play the next one, and Chris might have to do more push-ups. But um, no, it's, that's why this one mean, means a lot more than the first one we won, because we, we knew what was at stake. I'm always at peace with myself. <laughs> Always, don't you see this fly all the time? You know, they have issues that has to be dealt with. The main focus was to play this tournament and play to win, and then talk after. So now we've won, then we could talk. In 2012, we believed that we could win it. We needed uh, silverware in the, in the Caribbean. And uh, yes, they didn't give us a chance back then, but the way we, we played, you know, it was the first taste of glory or silverware since 2004 when we won the ICC. This one, with all that happened before the tournament, you know, the disrespect from commented from journalists, from our own cricket board, you know, that was out of order, and we just the only way we could make a statement is by winning this tournament. So when you see those 15 men out there playing with passion and determination and the hunger for success and victories, 
it all stems from what been boiling inside and now that is over you know we could talk about it but this victory is solely dedicated to to the Caribbean people the fans all over the world